My Party Dress was a really interesting process for us. That's a song that we wrote for the off-Broadway musical Henry and Mudge, but that's actually one of very, very few songs in Kate and my collaboration where we wrote it almost completely in the room. We had talked in advance about how we wanted the character of Annie to have a mind that jumped, that would go all the way down one thought and then suddenly just kind of pause for a moment and then leap somewhere else. And it would always be logical, but it would always surprise us with where she was leaping next. Did you see my party dress? This morning I was feeling dressy, mother thinks I'll get it messy, but you cannot see where I have spilled. I spilled here, and here, and here, and here, oh no. That was on my other dress. John Michael stole my birthday cake, and Jenna Walker tried to take my crunch and munch. It wasn't fair, I grabbed the punch, I climbed the chair, and then I fell and punch went everywhere. On the floor, on my chair, on his shoes, in her hair. But it wasn't on my party dress. John Michael once made fun of soccer, so I stuffed him in a locker. I play soccer and I play the flute. I do art and discovery camp and tumbling and t-ball. And I play piano every night. My dad says I'm a prodigy, but I think I would rather be the FBI or CIA, a secret spy who saves the day. And when I'm finished saving it, I'll play Ode to Joy, Engine Joe, Frere Jaca, Allegro, the Paca Bell Cannon, and also this song I wrote. Ah, ah, la 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 It has words. I'm a spy. And it's really fun. And I wear a cape. And did you see my party dress? When I do pirouettes at wrestles, I buy all my clothes in Brussels. Dad says that's where Brussels sprouts are from. I've toured Brussels and Paris and Vienna. And this one time we pretended to go to Rome, but we went to Iceland. <laughs> and in Iceland, my dad presided over an international corporate trade hearing. <gasps> And we saw the Reykjavik Ballet. My dance class is on Saturday. Miss Laura and Miss Lisa say I'm much more bright than I appear. I sashay right. It's very clear that I'll be in the Nutcracker next year as a mouse, then a soldier, then a candy cane, then a marzipan, then a Russian, and an angel, then a Polish Chanel. And another turn. Mother says, I'll quit. I will never quit. I will do a split. Someday. And I think that's it. Oh, and one day when I'm president, my bedtime will be very late. So I have time to legislate the kind of laws I think are cool. I'll pass a clause to banish and then all of the countries that I rule will be peaceful and happy and comfortable and satin and frilly and pretty. Ha 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 